Oh, sir! What is going on, everybody? Just hold on a second. That's about right. Okay, guys. What is going on? Look at this. Look how big this fucking thing is. This is going to be the biggest package I've received so far. We're back for another subscriber starter pack reaction, I assume. Well, sorry, opening. Sorry, what is it? Rugby player receives starter pack, fan starter pack of a particular team from a, from a player. Anyways, let's get into it. The quicker you're here, the faster you go. That's why where I come from, the only thing we know is... Oh, oh, oh. Look at it. Look how big this thing is. And it's from my guys across the ditch, USPS, as always. And it's actually from my man, William Quinn from Dallas, Texas. He's dropped a cool $97.90 US to send this to me, plus what's ever in the box. So look, man, before I open it, what a fucking legend. Welcome back to another YouTube, no, what is it? Rugby player reacts to, no, rugby player receives subscriber starter pack. No, it's not. Nick Minnett. It's rugby player receives fan starter pack from subscriber. So that's what I assume is in here. I can't remember what he said. I'm not gonna look up his Instagram message because I want it to be a surprise. So let's do this. Ah. Let's fucking do this. I love this shit, man. I'll never get sick of it. And I hope you guys enjoy it too. Okay, well that's no good to me. Where's my key? Okay, here we go. I'm excited. By the way, if you were wondering, a package like this from Dallas, Texas got sent on the 16th of October 2018. Today's date, I've just received it, the 31st. So that's two weeks. Let's get into it. William Quinn. What have we got here? <laughs> a blanket? <laughs> what do you make of that, guys? It's packed full. Oh, mate. All right. Okay. <laughs> it's either a towel or a blanket. Maybe, maybe it's a blanket for those cold, cold winter games when they're playing in six, six inches of snow. I'm not sure, I don't even know what's on it. What is on this thing? What does that say? North, North Texas. Neon green. No, mean green. North Texas, mean green. Established in 1890. North Texas. Oh. Man, we've got some more North Texas. I'm loving this. I haven't had any green yet. Boom! Sweet! We've got a, uh, some sort of uh, bird-like logo. Kind of looks like the Eagles logo, but I, I guarantee it's not. North Texas, apparently. Let's put this on. Oh, we've got an XL. And it fits perfectly. Now this is what I'm looking forward to. A hoodie. Everyone loves a hoodie. And especially when they look as sick as that. I've got to say, man, before I got into any of this football stuff, before I got into college football, I'd always known that I'd liked like your college style font. College style print. You know, whether it said... Mississippi, Alabama, like, uh, you know, could have said anything, I still would have liked it. So, to receive this, I mean, it's in the same fashion, grey, uh, silver, and white, and green, fuck. You know, that's another thing, these colour schemes are absolutely brilliant. I mean, the grey and red for, uh, for uh, Ohio State, you've got the, the, the maize and blue for um, Michigan, you've got green and white and silver for North Texas, you've got purple and yellow for LSU, you've got so many others and I really love them all and this is fucking sick. 
<laughs> I can tell you right now I'll be wearing this a lot. When it's cold enough. Oh, yeah. Perfect size, man. What size is it? X, size XL. Thank you, man. This is amazing. I love it. Absolutely love it. What do you got here? Drinking cups. With a straw. <laughs> North Texas. The tower. The fight song. Okay. What's this one? North Texas. Fly. Fly, fly. Okay. What do we got here? Scott Brown Properties. So these are just... These must be cups that you buy at the game. Got your coke, got your beer. Boom! Alright, we've got a letter here. Holy shit! Right, we're gonna read that at the end. Oh man. Holy fuck, this is gonna take forever. You have outdone yourself, my friend. You have absolutely outdone yourself. We've got this is this is definitely a starter pack, that's for sure. North Texas bag whatever you want to put in it. We've got the beanie. Oh, I love this. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Could you see me in the stands? You wouldn't know where I'm from. Yeah, I'm in, I'm in North Texas, bruh. Yeah, second year. Second year red shirt. Alright, we got some pencils! Pencil, pencil, pencil. I don't know when the last time I used a pencil was, and in fact, I don't have a pencil sharpener. But I do have a knife downstairs, so that's all good. This is fantastic. This is... This is beyond fantastic. This is unbelievable. Alright. Let's get through this. Holy shit, man. <laughs> oh, this, this, this playing jersey looks absolutely sick. Coaster for the bears. We've got a hat, we've got a strap back. I love my strap backs. In fact, I'm going to put this on right now. Beanie can wait. Oh, it's a bit small. <laughs> Maybe this is for a girl. I'm actually not sure. I think it might be for a girl. Although my head is a size double XL. No hats fit my head, but beanies do. So there you go. We've got we've got a key ring, key ring with number 75, and it says Mean Joe Green from 1966 to 68. Mean Joe Green. Well, we're going to have to have a look at him. Whoa. Ladner. Is this, is this a real playing jersey? Is this from a player? Number 91. Mean Green. I've got one, I've got another um, actual, like, playing jumper from, uh, North Dakota State in this similar style with like the, the room for the pads and stuff. Number 91. Well, we'll have to find out who that is. Oh. Like I said, anything with a college style print is an absolute winner in my books, including this one. XL, my man, North Texas. North Texas. North Texas what? <laughs> Eagles? What have we got here? Another one. I want to know what that is. Oh! Football magazines! Mate! Well, that's a first. Thank you, mate. I'll, uh, I'm actually going away on, on a trip soon, going away on holiday. It's going to be a bit of travel time, a bit of downtime. I'll be taking these, as well as... These two. 
two books on the Michigan-Ohio State rivalry. So, sweet man, I've got some reading. And I'll learn about the game of football. And what have we got here? Another, something else. Football cards. The Mean Green Standard. 2018 North Texas Football Fan Guide. Not approved for entry. All purses, bags, containers, larger than a small clutch bag, backpacks, binocular case, briefcases, camera bags, cinch bag, computer bags, coolers, fanny packs, and luggage of any kind. Oh man, I'm fucking hungry now. Veggie dogs, black bean burgers, salads, fruit cups, cheeseburgers, grilled chicken sandwiches, Philly cheesesteaks, mini corn dogs. Brisket sliders, brisket nachos, jalapeno cheese sausage wrap, brisket mac and cheese, the wrecker sandwich, Rudy's barbecue, Metzler's barbecue. Mate! Is this what they call tailgating? This sounds absolutely delightful. I'll have a read of that. And here we go. Here we go. Mean Joe Green. Mean Joe Green. Considered not only the greatest player in North Texas history, Mean Joe Green was rated the greatest defensive tackle in the history of football when the NFL named its top 100 greatest players. Well, I'm going to watch that. A three-time Missouri Valley All-Conference player, Green anchored a North Texas defensive line that allowed just two yards per rushing attempt from 66 to 68, helping North Texas to a 23-5-1 record. Green was a consensus All-American in 1968. Mean Joe Green. Here's another one. In 1969, Green was the first North, first North Texas player taken in the first round of the NFL Draft. Selected fourth overall by the Pittsburgh Steelers. His achievements included 69 Defensive Rookie of the Year, 10 Pro Bowl selections, 5 First Team All-Pro Honours, Defensive Player of the Year in 72 and 74, NFL Man of the Year in 79, and 4 Super Bowl Championships. What? Green is a member of the North Texas Athletics College Football and Pro Football Hall of Fame and his number 75 was retired by the University of North Texas and by Pittsburgh Steelers. Whoa, what a fucking legend. We've definitely got a legend on our hand here. Another one. Founded by his three children in loving memory of their late mother Agnes, the Green Family Foundation provides scholarships for students who, have, who are breast cancer survivors or who have a parent affected by the, by the disease. Joe and Agnes met while they were students at UNT and the foundation is a nod to her love of the university. In its first year, the foundation provided two scholarships to, to UNT students who then attended the annual Nibble and Mingle event. Featuring all-star chefs and a celebrity guest list, the event serves as the primary fund fundraiser for the foundation. Right, the Green, Fa Green Family Foundation. Supporting breast cancer. We've got one more, guys. I'm going to read it out. NFL 70s all-decade all teams. Joe Green. Here, here are some dates. 1980, he was named in the 70s all-decade team for the NFL. 1981, he was named in the North Texas Athletics Hall of Fame. 1981 also, his number 75 was retired by North Texas. In 84, he got inducted into the College Football Hall of Fame. 85, Texas Sports Hall of Fame. 87, Pro Football Hall of Fame. 94, the NFL 75th anniversary all-time team. In 2010, 16 years later, he got the top 100 NFL greatest players. I believe he's number one. 2014, number 75 was, re was retired by the Pittsburgh Steelers, who I'm assuming he played for. And in 2017, last year, he was named in the Texas High School Football Hall of Fame. So that's high school. So he's in one, two, three, four, five, six Hall of Fames. Holy shit. That's impressive. And we've got one last thing, last but not least, we've got to have a flag. And it looks as if that's what this is. But I still, it's, it's obviously just called North Texas. And that's it. There's no like North Texas eagles or North Texas birds or something like that. It's just North Texas. And that's upside down. So, I suppose 
I suppose it's time for a thumbnail, which means that we're going to have to go like this and uh, get that. So we will. Oh, get behind me there. And I want to say, William, man, this is amazing. This is amazing. Just like all of my other, you know, packages are from my subscribers. I mean, this is me checking my post box, not really expecting anything, getting a massive package, coming home, opening it. It's amazing. I feel like it's Christmas. And it kind of is Christmas in two months. But this hoodie's sick, man. I love the silver. I love the white. I love the green. I love the beanie. I love all the information. Mean Joe Green is coming up. But before I do go, this video has probably gone on about 15 minutes already. We have a letter. And as always, I am going to read it right now. To Jacob, greetings from the Mean Green Nation. I am so elated that you have come to embrace American football, especially the college game. I personally like it more as a whole over the NFL, but I still do love my Cowboys. I just like the college game as a purer sport. I'm a graduate of the University of North Texas in 2002. And since I have been at school here, I've always followed the football team from good and great years to lean and even, better, and even bad years. I will always follow this team through and through. I hope this care package is a great token of my appreciation to you for embracing American college football. Let me describe a few of the items. The white game jersey from 2010. When we, when we were still in the Sun Belt Conference, we are now in Conference USA. I don't remember the player exactly, but I think number 91 fits you. Well, the player is, is Ladner, my man. And uh, you know what? Thank you, my friend. A real playing jersey. Baseball cap and pom beanie hat. Size large North Texas white B in sports shirt and koozie. B in sports here does show UNT game set. Okay, so B, B sports must be a broadcaster. The world class sports network. Okay. A couple of greens, a green shirts and a hoodie, which is awesome. A three by five foot flag. Yes. A set of UNT pencils. A gift bag, two of my favourite college football preview magazines, the Anthlon's National College Football, and Dave Campbell's Texas Football. Okay, so we've got Athlon Sports College Football Magazine. That's going to be a good read. Dave Campbell's Texas Football. So I'm going to learn all about Texas. Brilliant. North Texas Plush Throw. Oh, this one. What's a throw? Must be a little blanket. An actual game program from our game against Louisiana Tech, which was here. This one. Mean Joe Green trading cards and bronze keychain from statue ceremony before LA Tech game. Foldable fan guide. Actual souvenir so soda cups from our home grounds. <laughs> As for YouTube clips for you to review, I have four of them for you, Jacob. But bold print and YouTube search bar to find clips easier. Okay. Number one. North Texas goal line stand versus Rice. October 31st, 2013. Goal line stand was for eight straight plays. The last play was the craziest. Okay. Number two. North Texas versus UTSA. Which is... I got no idea. Final drive. Here we had to go down the entire length of the field in a minute and two seconds with no timeouts. Piece of cake for our quarterback, Mason Fine. Number three, North Texas fake fair catch, the 90 yard punt return touchdown. So far this is the 2018 play of the year in college football. This is, pick of, this is a pick of me with the punt returner Keegan Brewer and the man that created the play, special teams coach Marty Biagi. Brilliant! Look at that! Way to name drop, bruh. Way to name drop. Number four. Any episode of this season of Beyond the Green 2018. This is our weekly show. It is a very in-depth look at our team. I really think you would like it, Jacob. One last picture I would like to show you is this picture from 2017. 
I'm on the very left, and next to me is Zach Orr, one of the great linebackers ever to play here. He played for the Baltimore Ravens for three years afterwards. Zach Orr, I've actually heard of him. I have. Next to him is, the fa is his father, Terry Orr, who used to play for the Washington Redskins. And on the very right was our running back, Brandon Bird, who led us to winning the Heart of Dallas Bowl in 2013-14 season. Jacob, I hope you enjoy your UNT swag box. University of North Texas. And go mean green. Sincerely, William Quinn. And that's the picture of him with uh, the ore. The ore guys and uh, the current running back. Oh no, Brandon Bird. 2013-14 running back. Sick, man. What a legend. What an absolute legend, mate. I, I am blown away, as I always am, but God, I mean, this is, <laughs> this is incredible. I love it. I love it all. I want to say thank you so much. I want to say stay tuned for the next few videos. They're going to be... He didn't actually mention anything about Joe Green. I'm going to have to look at him anyway. So, look, the next video, or two, or three, or four, is going to be dedicated to my man William Quinn. It's going to be associated with North Texas. And I can't wait. So if you have enjoyed this video, if you want to so support me and the growth of the channel, please press like. If you want to subscribe, please do. Go North Texas, baby. That's all I can say. Look at my pencils. <laughs>